So let's take a look at our qu four quick one click to edit flyers. Now this is just a quick publisher exercise in creating a simple flyer. And I've given you everything you need. We don't even need to get into creating your first document. Just download the zip archive from the places given and it's all yours. And you can see the four samples I've got on the screen there and you can change them as you like. Now first retrieve the archive. Install the Fire Sans font which is contained in the archive. And you'll find the archive containing the AF template, the AF publisher and sample PDF files as well as the zip file containing the Fire fonts. And they're on my website at those addresses. And I'll leave them there long enough or you can pause the video and copy them down or you may well know where they are by now anyway. They're in two locations because I'm slowly moving my website to a more reliable server. My own server is quite reliable, but, you know, sometimes you need a backup. Now, open either the Flyer Simple 4 version Master AF Pub, which is what you can see on the screen there, or Install the template where you put your templates and open it as a master template. But then save it with your preferred name. Of course, you don't want to save the template because you'll overwrite the template. And every time you load the template, you'll have to redo it all. Now, on flyer 1, 2, 3 or 4, and you see there's four of them down the side there. There's one master page and there's four pages. Each page is separate and is a separate flyer and you can see the layers contained therein and you can edit the text, edit the phone number, type in your name or your company name and down the bottom where you've got Facebook, uh, Twitter or YouTube you can put in your addresses next to those so people can find them. If you create these as PDF files that you're going to distribute of course, you can put in hyperlinks to those links down there. You can put in hyperlinks to anything, actually, and um, send people directly to your Facebook, Twitter, or YouTube page from that flyer, if it's a PDF and they're reading it digitally. But there's two different forms here. If it's going to a printer, then you need to export it as print-ready. If you're going to export to PDF for use on the web, then export it as a digital file. Now, export as a single page. If you only want one page, export it as a single page. Otherwise, it will export all four of them. And you don't want that. You only want one at a time. And you can see I've set it PDF for print and current page. Click on export and there's your page. Away it goes. What could be easier? Load the master file, select the preferred page, edit that page, export single page to PDF or your preferred format, and print it. Or not, as the case may be. You may be putting it on your website. But you've got four different versions there. Quick and easy. Now, that's my YouTube uh, website. And that's the YouTube address there. And it'd be really nice if you subscribed. Show your love. Thanks for watching this quick little intro. That's all we have.